Hi everybody, I'm Miss Marcia of the St. Johns County Public Library System. Welcome to today's episode of Our Big Backyard. Today we're going to take a closer look at gopher tortoises. Have you ever seen a gopher tortoise? If you've ever seen a gopher tortoise, you are very fortunate. Adult gopher tortoises have a gray, brown, domed shell. They have flat, shovel-like front feet for digging burrows, and elephant-like stumpy back legs. Their head is broad and their nose is flat. What do gopher tortoises eat? They use their eyes and their sense of smell to find delicious plants to eat. Like you, they take a sniff before they take a bite. They like grasses and a wide variety of low-growing plants. Even stinging nettles, prickly pear cactuses, and poison ivy. They don't have teeth, but they have a beak to cut the foliage and use their tongue to get it into their mouth. Gopher tortoises dig a burrow. They dig to keep from getting too hot or cold or wet. The burrow is a stable temperature and humidity and other animals need that too. It can be up to seven feet deep and 15 feet long. The gopher tortoise is a very important animal. Scientists call it a keystone species. Why is this animal so important? Just like the top stone or keystone in an arch keeps it from collapsing, a gopher tortoise holds its community together. It provides a stable shelter and home for as many as 350 different animals besides itself. All of these animals can be found using the gopher tortoise burrow as a home or a shelter from predators, fire, heat, cold, and rain. Three dozen animals use gopher tortoise burrows year-round. Some examples are gopher frog, Florida mouse, gopher scarab beetle, gopher cricket, and gopher moth. A tortoise will dig many burrows. After a gopher tortoise has abandoned a burrow, other animals like burrowing owls, armadillos, or foxes may move in. The endangered indigo snake also uses the burrow to raise its young. Gopher tortoises are ancient land reptiles. They do not swim. They get most of the water they need from the plants that they eat. a 
long time for gopher tortoises to mature and lay eggs, about 10 to 15 years. It takes about three months for the eggs to develop. Hatchlings are two inches at birth. The shell of a juvenile tortoise is yellow and brown. The top shell, called the carapace, stays soft for six to seven years. This makes the gopher tortoise very vulnerable, to dogs especially, for a long time. Gopher tortoises are threatened in Florida. This means the number of them is declining throughout the state. People and dogs disturbing them and their sandy upland habitat is the biggest reason for their decline. So now that we know how important the gopher tortoise is, let's look ahead and scan the road. Watch out for them, slow down for them, and work to save the places they live to ensure their survival and that of hundreds of other animals too. To learn more about gopher tortoises, check out books from your local library. The Gopher Tortoise Council and the Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission have more information online about gopher tortoises and how you can help. Thank you for watching today's episode of Our Big Backyard. Look forward to seeing you next time. I'm Miss Marcia of the St. Johns County Public Library System. Bye-bye.